All right, how's it going, everybody? This is 2020 Contenders Draft Picks Football. Uh, three box break. Pick your team number eight. The first thing we have to do in this one is randomize all 31 customer names. The top name will win the Cincinnati Bengals. Chance at some, uh, some Joe Burrow magic. So, Snake Eyes, two times. Good luck. One. And two. On, there you go. You are the winner of the Cincinnati Bengals. Congratulations. Not sure what's been pulled from this case. Don't think any Joe Burrow, though. I, would, I think I would have gotten a pic. I would have gotten a picture of that. No Tua. Herbert? No Herbert. No Herbert. So none of the top three quarterbacks. No Love. No Jordan Love. No Hurts. Jalen Hurts. Any Jake Fromm? No Fromm. No quarterbacks. No quarterbacks. Except for, like, Steven Montez. All right, good luck. Steve Montez is a quarterback. Yeah, I feel like he's been a rookie for like 10 years. All right, good luck. But yeah, um, I could probably bring that Black Diamond tomorrow. Just have to remember. All right, good luck. John says, who would have thought uh, winning the Bengals would be a top prize? Yeah, the Pelicans last year in 2018 products are, are terrible. Imagine imagine that, too. Bengals weren't great last year. Strange Pelicans. Times. Strange times. Nick, you don't mind a chance to have a, that, any of that team all select, do you? Football? Yeah. No. Did someone buy one? No, no. Okay. I knew that, you know, last week we had some. No. All right, no vet base ships, only inserts, and of course autos. First one is James Prochet. Looks like from, is that the SMU Mustang? Why does it say Dallas on his jersey? Oh, shoot. What happened? That was trippy. I think it's probably like a hot key for... Yeah. Um, James Proche, Baltimore. That is going out to Aaron Billingsley. You randomize these left, right? Oh, no. This is Bengals. Yeah. That Joe Burrow insert. Oh, totally been doing those. It's the same team, actually, so... Derek Brown, he was a top pick, right? Bowl ticket auto. Derek Brown. Where did he go, Ted? Derek Brown from Auburn, defensive tackle. He oh, yeah. went. He went to the Car Carolina Panthers. You didn't have to say that. Fred Williams. He looks pretty slim in this photo. Derek Brown. Ted says he's got a big stomach. That guy. He's 6'5", 318. That seems appropriate for a defensive tackle. 6'5", 318? Yeah, he's a stud. That doesn't even register in my head. 6'5". Like, like, yeah, you, you so my own. No, 318, though. Like, having having three in front of your, like, weight, like, that's the first number. When I was a kid, I remember, like... Michael Warren, the second. I saw the Hulk Hogan. They probably wrestling yeah. cards. I remember on the back of the, the Hulk Hogan card, it was 300-something, and I was like... What? Eagles, yeah, like, that like, is... Like, Fred? Now I wake up and there's a three in front of my friggin' number. <laughs> this guy's 5'11", 222. Yeah, that, that's, that sounds normal, though. Once you start putting three in front on your way, Tua? that's just crazy. Ooh, we got a cracked ice coming up of Baker Mayfield for the Browns. That one's going uh, out to Glenn, number 23. 
Is Southern Methodist University located in Dallas? I think so. I didn't, I didn't think so. Colin Johnson, maybe Isn't it, it is. I don't remember it being close to Dallas, but I lived there for ages one and two, so I don't know. For some reason, I thought I thought it was more like. That's Jaguars. More closer, like Tyler, Texas, or something. Like David further, Baker. Further east, but maybe yeah. it's closer to Dallas. Though. And we have a Devin Duvernay auto. Another Longhorn. This one goes to the Ravens. Baltimore. Aaron Billingsley. And we have a Rodney Smith. Thanks, Riffer. Riffer's on it. All right, so we got contenders Panthers. now. Oh, sorry. We got That's contenders Fred. now. Mosaic, two box cello, random team five after this. That's 24 cello packs. Then we've got NT football, two box, half case, and then the random number block. And we got Donner Soft and Mega, pick your team one, four box break, should be pretty quick. Court Kings two, Court Kings three, and that should bring you to around 11.30 Pacific. Cool, yeah. So you, and then, and then good night. We're done after that, folks. Thanks. Nice day. Nice. Non-stop breaking for 10, 11 hours. Yeah, I probably didn't know what a Mustang was back then. I know it's comfy here, Mac. I don't get to use this sofa too often. It's actually working. What's up, Aaron? How's it going? Nice, Henry Ruggs the third. Very nice one there. Broncos, right? Henry Ruggs. Raiders. I, I Come on, can, man. Uh, I confuse him with uh, Judy. The, the, the guy the Raiders should have taken. Uh, that's on. I noticed you changed them to Vegas already. Oakland slash Vegas. I think you got to pick one though. I, you, I you can't. originally did that because I thought that we would still have some 2019 products. Yeah, we're down on 2019. Chronicles was the last one. Yeah, but we still we still do an NT tonight. Yeah, but then you could say that for you know <laughs> the Bobcats. Right, we do 2012 true. product. Yeah, I'll change it. Joe Reed yeah. Auto. It'd be weird if I move it up to the where the L. You got to get used to it, right? Yeah, I gotta get used to it. Got to get used to it at some point. Joe Reed Chargers. We switched to Chargers. Uh, that's Matthew Shira. That's true. I did pull it up from SD up to LA. Yeah, I'll change it. I, it's an official move then, once we submit that. Yeah, now it's official. The Raiders have officially moved. Once it changes on our on our paperwork, folks. Bryson Hopkins. No, the Dodgers pillow is still right. Still, Dodgers pillow still has a tag on it. I haven't even slept on this yet. Bryson Hopkins. Rams. The Ramily. Scott B. Now your show notes page is updated, too. Coolio, thank you. Terry Bradshaw does not look like a uh, collegiate athlete there. <laughs> Standards are different back then. His face was different. Like, his face, he just looks like a grown man in that one. Uh, Kendrick Rogers. Cowboys. Dallas. On. Shea Patterson. Nice one there, the Michigan quarterback. I don't know if he got drafted. I think he 
went uns undrafted. But looks like he ended up as a chief. Maybe battling for the backup position behind Patrick Mahomes. The KC Chiefs. Mike Lang. I feel like he kind of had a Heisman buzz for a little bit there, huh? Should have one more auto. It is for Omar Bayless. Arkansas State. Omar Bayless is a Panther. I feel like I called them a few times. Fred Williams. All right. Riffer says, I googled the SMU Dallas uniform. Uh -huh. What do we got? Nothing yet. Oh. Still <laughs> waiting for him to follow what, up. What a tease, Riffer. It's very tease. That's a professional tease right there. He should, be, he should be in the radio business. It's a special road uni they used as a branding project for their program. I guess so, like, when recruits watch their games, they'll see, oh, it's nearby Dallas. Oh, maybe. Like, we we didn't know. Yeah. I thought, it stopped, I thought it was just, like, in West Texas in the middle of nowhere. I see you, SMU. I see you. Now, recruiting game, though. College. Recruiting is crazy if you think about it. Crazy. Crazy. I feel like it's a nonstop position. You're recruiting. ABC always be closed. You're recruiting like 16-year-old kids. I just think of the blindside scene when they have all the uh, coaches come in, like Nick Saban and Coach O and stuff. Oh, yeah. Uh, there's Rico Dowdle. That's also a funny, like, um, YouTube ad that comes up. It's like, why Michael Orr doesn't like how he was portrayed in the blindside. That's always a video on, on the recommended, yeah. I haven't seen that one yet. Or like one of those like ad headlines that you mistake for a news thing. Random thoughts. I'm bummed that we don't get a chance to see fans in the stands because I can only imagine what size. And we have Jake Luton. I keep adding this as a bookmark. It's terrible. Luton is Jags. I feel like they've hit a few times too. David Baker. Oregon State quarterback. Why do I have a receipt in my sweater? I don't know. Justin Madbuki, number to 99. Oh no. McDonald's on Artesia? What did I get? Oh god. June 2nd at 1.02 p.m. Sausage Egg McMuffin. Ravens on that one. Ash brown and a cop. Oh, that was like last week, wasn't it? That was really recent, yeah. Mm, I remember it. It was delicious. Jalen Rager, number to 15 for the Eagles. Look at it. That's an on-card uh, contender's optic style. Best wide receiver in the draft? Best receiver, <laughs> rookie receiver ever. Ever. 10 of 15 for the Eagles, Fred Williams. Last spot, Mojo. Nice hit. I like the contenders optic that they sneak that in there. We have a Brian Edwards. Any relation to Braylon Edwards? Brian Edwards is a Raider. South Carolina. Dynamic playmaker. Vegas Raiders on. The Raiders. Dynamic. Then Ruggs. Edwards, Lynn Bowden Jr., woo, electric. The neon lights of Vegas will be burning bright for those playmakers. Woo. And, you know, this one, Texas A&M, Courtney Davis. No. You think it's Courtney? I, with a Q, right? Yeah, do you yeah, think it's no, Courtney? I, I think it's definitely Courtney. Or is it, like, Quartz? Court. No. I think it's Courtney Davis. How do you say, like, uh, like a Sorbonne, diamond? Like Cortland Sutton? Like, I think it's Courtney. No, like a quartz of a diamond. Yeah, well, that's Q-U-A-R-Quartz. Quart? Quartz. Do you do a quartz or court? Quartz. Quartz. Q-U-A-Z-T-R-Z. <laughs> Q-U-A-Z-T-R-Z. Are you saying core or core? Core. Core. Taco Bell or Taco Bell? 
Wait, say that again? Taco Bell? Do you go to Taco Bell? Or do you go to Taco Bell? I went to Taco Bell. I don't hear a difference. So you, some people put the emphasis on the taco, some people put the emphasis Vikings. on the Bell. That's uh, Vikings. That's Mitchell. Do you hear Yanni or Laurel? Remember that one? No. That was a good old internet thing. So there you go. That was a break. Thanks, everybody, for getting in. Three box. Pick your team number eight. The dress is blue.